quantifiers with count and non-count nouns. We use quantifiers to give the amount of something. Quantifiers usually come before nouns. We do a little exercise in the morning. There are many people crossing the street. Quantifiers with plural count nouns. Count nouns are nouns that can be singular or plural. Quantifiers we often use with plural count nouns include a few, a lot of, and many. We use a few to show a small amount. I need a few minutes to relax. We use many and a lot of to show a large amount. Libraries have many books. There are a lot of ships in the ocean. Quantifiers with non-count nouns. Non-count nouns are singular, never plural. Quantifiers we often use with non-count nouns include a little, a lot of, and not much. We use a little to show a small amount. I take a little sugar in my coffee. We use a lot of to show a large amount. My grandfather has a lot of patience. We use not much in negative statements. Hurry up. We don't have much time. Using a few and a little. Read the sentences. Complete each sentence with a few or a little. I have a little coffee when I wake up. We saw a few good movies last summer. There is a little soup left if you want some. I have a little work to do before I go home. We brought a few friends with us. He has a few things to ask you. Using many and much. Read the sentences. Complete each sentence with many or much. There are many people at the mall. There isn't much traffic on Sunday. I don't drink much soda anymore. We don't have much luggage to check. Many artists live in this part of town. Boston has many colleges and universities. How many and how much? We use how many and how much to ask about the amount of something. We use how many with plural count nouns. How many loaves of bread should we get? How many vitamins do you take? We use how much with non-count nouns. How much water do you drink a day? How much food do you want? Using how many and how much. Read the questions. Complete each question with how many or how much. How many countries are there in the world? How much information is on the internet? How much sugar do you take in your coffee? How many children do they have? How many vacations do you take per year? How much rest did the doctor suggest? Too many and too much. We use too many and too much to say we have more than we want or need of something. Too many and too much usually have a negative meaning. We use too many with plural count nouns. He plays too many video games. Don't eat too many fries. We use too much with non-count nouns. I have too much work to do. There's too much traffic. Using too many and too much. Read the sentences. 
Complete each sentence with too many or too much. Don't drink too much caffeine before bed. There are too many people waiting in this line. I think you paid too much money for your car. We've had too much rain, so the river is very high. This test has too many problems to solve. I try not to give my kids too many sweets. Enough and not enough. We can use the quantifiers enough and not enough with both plural count nouns and non count nouns. We use enough plus a noun to say that the amount is appropriate. There are enough chairs for everyone. I think we have enough work to do. We use not enough plus a noun to say that the amount is too little. I do not have enough stamps to mail this letter. There is not enough time to finish. Using enough and not enough. Use the words to make a sentence with enough and a sentence with not enough. We have enough food for dinner. We do not have enough food for dinner. There is enough milk in the fridge. There's not enough milk in the fridge. There are enough people to take a vote. There are not enough people to take a vote.